Well, Doug and Shelley, Trump touched on a dozen issues during his speech. Things he says are plaguing New Mexico, like crime and unemployment. And the answers that he gave got a big response from the crowd. A massive crowd packed Atlantic Aviation's hangar as Republican presidential candidate Donald Trump made his entrance. It is so great to be here in New Mexico. Trump spoke for just under an hour, hitting the issues his New Mexican supporters wanted to hear. He talked about the state losing jobs over the last few decades, specifically in manufacturing, but promised, if elected, to bring industry back to the state. More companies opening up their doors in New Mexico. You will be this place will be hot as a pistol, I promise you that. Trump also touched on crime, saying Albuquerque's rate of violent crime increased 53% from last year. Yeah, did you know that? 53%. What's going on out there? What's happening? 53%? That's a lot. Why? He quickly turned the blame to the state's neighbor to the south. Drugs pouring into New Mexico. So we're going to stop that. Trump hit a home run with the crowd when he spoke about bolstering the military. Did you ever hear a place called Kirtland, huh? Yeah. Kirtland. Kirtland Air Force Base right here in New Mexico. A lot of investment going there. It's a great base too, by the way. When Trump asked how many people had early voted, hundreds of hands shot up. Martha Mayers was one of them. I don't like what I've seen. And I think there might be some hope that someone new. That someone new for her would be called President Trump. So you might remember last time Trump was in Albuquerque for a rally. He had several protesters thrown out it for interrupting his rally. Tonight, only one person was removed from the crowd. Live at Atlantic Aviation, Kirsten Swanson, KOAT Action 7 News.